welcome back to my channel. Today is all about those brows. Brow down, ladies, brow down, okay? Um, I see so many women struggle with brows and brows are so fun for me to talk about because they can literally make or break your makeup look, okay? Um, you cannot just watch one of your favorite YouTubers and create her brow on your face. It won't necessarily work because we all have different face shapes. So today I'm gonna teach you how to measure your brows, where you need to start, where you need to arch, and where you need to end for your personal face shape. And I gotta tell you, it's pretty simple to do. So if you like this video, make sure you hit subscribe in the bottom right hand corner. Show me some love. Let me know what you would like to see me do. And let's get started on our brow. <laughs> A brow product that you truly love whether you are a brow pencil girl a brow powder girl a brow pomade kind of girl it is totally up to you um, I am definitely a brow palette kind of girl I love this palette by unique because it has everything you need it's got your um, gel here it's got two highlighters here which I'll show you how to use and then it also has a darker powder and a lighter powder so literally it is everything you need in one palette so the very first thing I do is I take a spoolie and I just literally brush up and out my eyebrows okay this is just to me I call it waking them up letting them know mama is here to play and they best be getting in shape now, to measure your brows, this is probably the most important of the whole brow tutorial because if you don't do the correct shape for your face, it's just not gonna look right, okay? So this is really, really important to do. So what I do, I take the lighter powder to, um, blah, 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 blah. I take the lighter powder to measure. So I just grab a little bit of that, and the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna start on the end of your nose, you're gonna look straight ahead, you're gonna go on the end, the end of your nose here and you're gonna take it up. Now where that meets is where your brow needs to end. So just put a little dot there. Okay, can you see that? I don't know, like a little hashtag there so you know where to take it to end it, okay? Now where it's going to arch, you take it at the end of your nose. Again, you're gonna take it right at the edge of your iris. Just go straight up and that is where you're gonna want it to arch, all right? And then for where it starts, you want to go where your, um, where your tear duct is, and you're gonna go straight up from that. So clearly, I've had many years of over plucking, and I need to lengthen them a bit. Okay, so that is how you are gonna know exactly where your brow needs to start, where it needs to arch, and where it needs to end for your face shape. So next up, we start drawing, okay? I like to mix the powder and the gel and just kind of put it here on the lid of the brow palette. Here we go. We are going to start on the bottom. Oh, that's what's tickling me, I brush hair on my nose. Ooh. We're gonna start on the bottom of the brow where it needs to start and we are gonna go straight back. So here we go. So I start here and I just go straight back, okay? Straight back. Then we're gonna go on the top part. I like to just start kind of where my natural hair is. So then we go right on the top and we go straight back again to where you want it to start arching. All right, so now we're gonna take and we're gonna go from where we want it to arch and we're gonna go straight down. And then we just go straight down. Now I just go in with the powder and I start to fill that in. Well, I actually use both powders and I'm gonna show you that here in just a minute. Okay, so now once I get it filled to here, as you can see, there's still some space here that I need to fill in. That is when I start to grab the lighter powder and I'm just going to blend it in. So I just take that lighter powder and I just start to kind of tap it in to the darker color. Okay, so now 
let's do this side and then I'll show you how to highlight. All right, once you get them the way you want them, um, clearly they look super bold right now, but that's only because I haven't done um, my eye look. So right now I'm looking a little bit like either Bert or Ernie, I don't even know which one, off of Sesame Street. <coughs> but once I do my eyes, I promise, they'll get together okay so here we go now what I do a lot of people use concealer to kind of clean up the lines um, that's fine you can do that uh, but with the palette it already has this little pink here so what I do is I like to I flip this brush over and I use the flat side and I just really kind of push up into my brow with that pink and what it's doing is it's not only cleaning up the line but it's actually adding some highlight underneath it as well so it's kind of multi-purpose which is why i love it so see how that added just some highlight under there and it helped clean it up it just looks it makes it look more fine. <laughs> 